Did you know that there is a death risk of every time that I try and set up that camera? Hi everybody, it's me, your friendly neighborhood, Bailey Plays Drums. Uh, welcome to my channel, and today I'm going to be playing this thing that I like to call Old Scrappy. Old Scrappy used to be an old ass, old scratchy, and uh, for good reason. It's uh, got this horrible buzzsaw scratch in, in there that just rattles like crazy and gives it a very gnarly and trashy sound. 19-inch um, A medium crash. The duct tape you saw in there is to dull it out, keep it from going crazy with resonance in the spots where it'll crack further, and then also, uh, separately, it, it's, it's there to... Uh, help me make it sound like a ride for these uh, current videos. I'm going to be removing the tape. I'm going to be using the groove juice to polish it up as shiny and brand new and nice as I can. And that's all going to be after I take uh, the same filing uh, techniques that I used on the Sabian, which worked. I'm going to grind, well, I'm going to I'm gonna just, you know, it's gonna be kinder than grinding, okay? I'm just gonna file it nice and soft and smooth, sometimes aggressively, but mostly soft and smooth, the way we all like it. And, uh, and hopefully it won't perforate against each other anymore, and it won't be very loud, but it will hopefully not sound like garbage. Sorry to talk about that forever. Let's see what it sounds like when we play some. The jerry-rigged O-ring is still being used as much as I can. Let's, uh... Oh yeah, let's give it a nice, uh, pop. Alright. <clears throat> let's do something in D minor.
I promise I will not keep doing that. <clears throat> well, everyone, um, I had a lot of fun. If you couldn't tell, I started to get into it a little bit. Uh, as it should be when you when you play. Uh, get a song in your head, whether it's a real song or you're just riffing around like I do. Play to something. Try to try to keep it steady, try to keep it interesting. Don't necessarily try to overplay. You're just jamming for this kind of thing. If you're working on technique, that's another thing. I'm not gonna sit here and record myself doing my warm-ups and workouts. I record jams. I occasionally record me playing some attempted a cover or something, but it's really just jams, reviews, and uh, that's what I want to do. You do what you want to do, I'm going to do what I want to do. What I want to do is hit 100 subscribers so that I can get my address changed on YouTube so I can stop being ashamed of it. So uh, if you could help me out in that manner, it would be incredibly cool. And all you have to do is hit the subscribe button. No bell needed, nothing. I'll put up a video that says that I've got to the 100 subscribers and I've changed the name. And you can unsubscribe. I, I will play to four people. I, I do not I do not do this for fame, for money, for whatever supposedly people think they can get from this. This is a video log for me. I'm doing my thing. I appreciate you coming along for the journey. It's been a long transition. And uh, from broken to uh, figuring out what to do with life, the drums have been there for me the whole time. My technique has been getting better. My finesse has been getting better. And uh, I, the more and more astounded I am by just the different things that you can do with every single piece. So I hope that music and or just drums can do that for you. And if not, live vicariously through me if, you, if you'd like. Thank you all again. I'm sorry for ranting. I need to stop this. I need an editing program so that I can shut up. But uh, until then, enjoy the iPhone, and I appreciate you all incredibly. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. Kawhi love, and we will see you in the next video. Subscribe.